Good afternoon. Well, I'm in the Aussie bush today and I'm going to take a walk in the Aussie bush about a kilometre or so into the bush off the uh, fire trail and I'm going to look for a subject to paint. There's some beautiful uh, boulder rocks and all that up in here and um, I just got to navigate my way through the bush and uh, find something to paint but I'm pretty sure what I want to paint is I want to paint a um, obviously gum tree the sun's actually in shadow at the moment but uh, it will come back out but I want to paint a gum tree with some boulder rocks or something so yeah that's the plan and uh, let's get into the bush and have a look what we can find Wow, well, check out these caves. These caves look a bit unique. Let's jump up and have a look, eh? Oh, I might leave these here. Oh. Oh. No one living up here. <laughs> wow, interesting, eh? Wow. Uh, not bad, eh? Oh, beautiful. Love the Aussie bush. Check out this massive tree fern. Wow, look at the canopy on it. Bit of a rainforest down there by the looks of it. Ah, we'll continue on. The wind's picked up a bit. Hopefully where I'll be, we'll be okay. Uh, and the sun's coming out too. So uh, yeah, five minutes ago the wind was crazy. But uh, we're a little bit protected here, I guess. So what I'm going to do is just head over, over over here. There's some boulder rocks I can see through there. Just head over this way and uh, see what's over here. Okay, what I'm liking is is this scene here. I like the two trees, the gum trees. And I like the boulders that are in front here. This grass tree's in the way, but I can I can move that around. I might put it to the right or not even put it in at all, but that's the scene I'm going for. And there's not some nice soft clouds behind. And uh, I'm in the scrub and um, I'll get set up and we'll get painting. And the good thing is there's not too much wind here. There is wind just down a bit, but here there's not that much wind. So yeah, let's get painting. Okay, so we've got the weather changing a lot. There's a lot of clouds rolling in. So uh, one minute I'm in cloud, in shadow, and uh, next minute I've got sunshine. So um, I want to work quick as I can to get this done. So I'll get the sky end in the clouds, and then I'll work on the trees in the background, and then come forward with the, the gum trees and the rocks. Sun's coming from the right, and there's some good uh, rays coming through the clouds.
get the dark color of the clouds I'm using uh, yellow ochre with white, titanium white and then I'm using ultramarine blue and burnt sienna to try and get that dark shadow color of the clouds in seems to be more darker on the left side Okay, what I'm going to do is uh, I've made up the bush green trees colour. I'm going to soften that in, get all that in, and then uh, I'll focus on the gum trees after that. There's so much scrub and bush, but the key is, is not to overdo it. Just get a lot of um, bracken and bits and pieces in and um, yeah, just don't overdo it. I'll emphasize the light once I get it all in.
Okay, I'm nearly done. I just got to do the rocks now. And we'll have a look at it. Okay, so I've done the painting. What I didn't do, there's so many rocks, I just put a handful of rocks. Um, otherwise, I didn't want to overdo it with the rocks, even though it looks so great. And I didn't put the grass tree in the front. But there's the trees there. With a subject like this, it's you can always go over the top, and I didn't want to go over the top. But I think I caught the essence of the painting. So let's have a look at the painting. So there's the painting on this beautiful day in the bush. Anyway, thanks for coming along and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.